Hello YouTube, welcome to Black Pearl's Place again and thank you guys so much for tuning in. For those of you that are still with me, thank you so much and for my new subbies, I appreciate it. And if you like these videos, please thumbs up and click the subscribe button so that you can help me build my channel. Help me, I help you, you know, mi casa su casa. Yeah. So today's review is going to be on this beautiful unit that I'm wearing. Uh, this is a full wig and it is not a lace front. It is Freetress Equal Invisible L Part Wig. Now, I don't quite understand the L part, but it says it's an L part. It looks like a straight part to me. And um, it has the Invisible L part hand tied lace and the style is Liberty. The color I am wearing is 1B and when I tell you this unit is beautiful, I mean the luster, everything about it looks very realistic to our hair. Um, this is how she looks. So yeah. The color on the card is OF2730613. Now that's a long number. But yeah, she's beautiful. I did pluck the parting, but you didn't really have to because the parting was really, really nice. So I'll get a little closer so you can see. I plucked the parting and you, you can probably tell that I added concealer. I was a little messy with it, but... I was kind of rushing. Anyway, this is how much I plucked from the parting. So, not a whole lot, but enough for it to look more realistic. But like I said, the parting space was really nice by itself. And I just wanted it to be a little bit bigger. So, I... I started plucking it with my tweezers. Now tweezers can cause damage to the lace uh, unit itself if you really don't know how to tweeze your parting. So my advice would be to just pull it for, with your hand. Just take small pieces like maybe this much and just pull it on out. It causes le less damage to the lace area and it keeps you from tearing it. So if you're not skilled with the tweezers, do not tweeze the parting. Just use your hand and the pull out method. You'll get the same results, I guarantee you. So let me show you the unit. And you guys already know how she comes in the little uh, plastic bag with, you know, the cardboard and the stuffing and everything. And, the care but instructions this and this is the back I love how tapered the back is and this is this side I did not cut this unit at all this is straight out of the oh, package and I wanted to show you all the hairline I pulled a lit a little bit of my hair out on the hairline so that it'll have a more natural look when the wind blows you can pull out more if you want but i just pulled out a little bit and you can use some edge control to slick it down i didn't want to go through all that because yeah like i said i was in a hurry and wanted to uh get this review done for you all and she has a lot she's of really beautiful she's very light and great for the hot weather that we're getting now so yeah um i'll list the price of this unit right here uh because i don't quite remember right now but yeah and go online and find this unit and good luck with her i love her this is totally different from me it's a nice bob style and it's pretty much off your shoulders so yeah it, it when you go outside it blows with the wind it's just a really beautiful unit so thank you guys for watching and 
For those of you that are curious about the color I'm wearing on my lip, this is a beautiful purple and I have absolutely no idea what the name of the color is because I ordered this lipstick from Shop Miss A and it was only a dollar. But look how pigmented this color is. And it comes in a tube like this and I'll swatch it. Look at that. It's very creamy and they added some fragrance to it so that it doesn't, you know, smell like, I don't know. Anyway, it smells really good, but it was only a dollar on Shop Miss A and look how pigmented it is. I do have a little bit of gloss with it to give it that little pop, but yeah, until the next video, I will see you all later. Bye-bye.